My name is Syed Rashid. I'm the product marketing manager for JBoss Data Grid at Red Hat. So Red Hat JBoss Data Grid is an in-memory data management system, which means it keeps all the data that an application requires in the memory instead of on the disk. That makes application works much faster. It can be used as a distributed cache, as a NoSQL database, as an event broker, and as an accelerator for IoT or big data solution. One of the critical problems that applications fa uh, developers face is they can always add application servers to scale out their applications, but what about the data tier? How do you scale out the data tier? So that is one of the biggest bottleneck. Uh, you can have multiple application servers, but they all go and attack the same database. With JBoss Data Grid actually provides a scale out architecture for your data tier. So you can basically keep adding the node, and as your application scales out, your data tier scales out, and you get consistent high performance applications. There's a saying that memory is the new disk and disk is the old tape. So the idea is make your application work faster at the speed of memory. Your application runs inside the memory. So have the data that application requires also available in the memory so they can work at the same speed. Because most of the applications, disk I.O. is the biggest problem that impacts the application performance. Developers should use JBoss Data Grid if they want to build an application that provides superior user experience. What, what it means is it, it acts instantaneously. It provides instantaneous uh, response times. It shows the data, it shows the information instantaneously. There is no lag, there is no delay. Um, because nobody wants to wait. Nobody wants to use a slow application. And that's, that's a key. Uh, we see this in a lot of industries where just one second lag in application response time or website web application response time that can impact the conversion rate of how you convert your e-commerce, you know, browser, you know, uh, people who are just browsing your e-commerce site to buying from that site. So, application response time, application experience is a key driver that developers should consider using JBoss Data Grid for. Yeah, so um, one of the new features we are introducing is um, support for Java Stream, which makes uh, uh, Java, uh, so which makes uh, it very easy to develop um, highly parallel, high performance application. It basically a simplified ma way to, um, uh, to implement the the, uh, the results you get with MapReduce. So think about, you know, um, MapReduce was used to um, crunch very large data sets, um, build applications that are highly parallel, um, can work concurrently. Now what we are doing is, okay, you can do all those things, but m using much simpler e APIs and not the learning curve that you otherwise incur learning how to do this in a MapReduce fashion. So th it's basically um, makes it a smooth, you know, smoother learning curve because it's something that they are, most of the Java developers are very familiar with. They can just use the API, they know how to do it. They don't have to rethink the, okay, I need to think in terms of a mapper and reducers and all that stuff. So it's a simplified way to uh, implement MapReduce.